California's historic drought led to new restrictions today on water use. State regulators voted to outlaw watering lawns more than twice a week and within 48 hours of a rainstorm. Restaurants can serve water only if customers request it. 93% of California is facing severe drought. In 67% of the state, it's extreme. Here's John Blackstone. The March measurement of the snowpack in California's Sierra Nevada mountains came just after a fresh snowfall, but that did not impress Frank Gerke of the Department of Water Resources. And makes for a, you know scenic photographs, but really has minimal impact in terms of water supply. After the driest January on record, California's reservoirs may hold just one year's water supply. Well drillers in the state have been busy. Steve Arthur has had farmers lined up for one of his half dozen rigs. All going down 1,000, 1,200 feet? Yep, and from this job site, we go up the road here about a mile and a half. We got another 1,000 footer. The need for deeper wells adds to worry the water table under the Central Valley is being depleted. Dairy farmer Joey Oroso depends on well water to grow feed for his 2,700 cows. Do you worry that it'll come a time that no matter how deep you drill here, you won't be able to pump up water? I think everybody's worried about that. Here we're looking at California. NASA water scientist Jay Familietti uses a satellite to measure the drought. The dark red shows California is drying out 11 trillion gallons below normal. To satisfy this deficit of 11 trillion gallons of storage, we would need about three years of above average precipitation. But with California going into a fourth year of drought, farmers are worried some of the most productive agricultural land in the country is on its way to becoming desert. John Blackstone, CBS News, Pixley, California.